Hey guys, it's Matt Skateboard. Um, in light of me ordering my Dell Mini 9, which is coming Friday, if you haven't heard from my other videos, um, I'd like to um, make the next few videos about netbooks. This one about choosing the right netbook. For me, the Dell Mini 9 was an easy choice because I plan on, in the future, installing um, Mac OS X on it. Also, it was one of the cheapest options since they don't make it anymore, and I got it refurbished for about uh, 157 or 155 or 153 um, after tax. So um, there are lots of many reasons to get a netbook for me if you want to install Mac OS X because the netbooks are generally the perfect machine to run these on. Um, and also, um, you know, if you want a little portable computer to bring around. You know, just go on the internet, check your emails. You don't need a lot of space on the computer. Um, so those are the main two reasons people get netbooks. But if you're going to go for the Mac OS X option, um, there's a website. And Boing Boing has posted um, a compatibility chart, as you see here, um, for all the netbooks installing Mac OS X. Um, as you can see, um, there are a couple of netbooks right here more than a couple actually looks like well over 10 maybe um, let's see if yeah so about uh, 17 um, you can see over here it shows all the things that will work and will not work um, so for this you can see the Dell Mini 9 is perfect across the board um, so that is good um, and that's the main reason. Some of these, um, to work perfectly, require a little hacking. Like, for example, my first choice was the HP Mini 1000. First of all, it was a tad pricey, um, and also I didn't really like the look of it, but to get sound to work, you had to install a driver, and the install was just, like, it seemed a lot more, uh, complicated than, um, the Dell Mini 9. Because the Dell Mini 9, you simply have a bootloader disk and the regular Leopard install CD. So that is one of the easier ones. Um, as you can see, uh, what's one of the other ones? I think it was the MSI Win U100. That Wi-Fi does work, but you have to end up replacing your Wi-Fi card, which was too complicated. I didn't want to get into that. Um, they just did add recently, well not just add, June 19th apparently, um, the MSI Win U120. I did like this, but um, it, once again it was a little bit more expensive. The Dell Mini 9 was only 140 before tax um, with everything I needed. So um, really that's how I decided the Dell Mini 9. Um, so look at this website, link in the description, um, if you need to decide which computer to get um, netbook to get in terms of installing Mac OS X. So now I'm going to talk about just basic net usage. Really what you need to decide is first of all do you need a full-size keyboard? Do you want that? For that I would suggest the HP Mini 1000 or the Dell Mini 9 or 10 or 10V. Um, those notebooks have almost full-size keyboard. I think the HP Mini 1000 series all have at least 92% full-size keyboards, so those are good. If you want big hard drives, then also go with the HP Mini 1000 series or MSI Wind, and I'm pretty sure Lenovo S10. Um, if you want to go with price, Dell Mini 9 or even Dell uh, Mini 10V which is what replaced the Dell Mini 9, is only $300. Um, I think you can get an H -mini, HP Mini 1000 for around 280 from Best Buy. Um, so basically, netbooks are a great platform, and I think a lot of people are starting to pick them up more and because they really are um, great systems. So like I said before, this is basically the next few videos I'm going to be making are about netbooks in light of... Um, my Dell Mini 9, which will come Friday. So, video schedule right here. Um, maybe some more videos about netbooks. Dell Mini 9 unboxing. Dell Mini 9 boot up. Dell Mini 9 tutorial on how to install Ubuntu Netbook Remix. Um, 
let's see. Um, also, when I get a new SSD, well, there will be an unboxing for that, as well as installation guide, as well as installation um, on how or a tutorial on how to install Mac OS X legally, kind of, of course. Um, so, um, basically, um, good luck searching for a good netbook to buy. Um, I'm at Skateboard. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.